We want things to be permanent. We want to live forever. We want things to stay the same. And I think there's a real like outside expectation of art to, to do that. And I, I disagree. I think it's better to accept that things aren't permanent and things will change and you can only experience things in one point in time and in one moment and then it's gone. I think that is what is important and exciting about getting to exist. And I think that art is the same. V turned into a sun. <laughs> I think for the most part, I would probably say uh, a lot of my work is uh, playful, it's kind of fun, can get a little dark. I kind of always was, was in, interested in art, like ever since I was little. I definitely uh, preferred to just like draw uh, in my, my school journals than, than write stuff. It's just It was always something I, I was excited to do. It's always been really hard for me um, trying to figure out how to be an artist. There wasn't really a lot of people like, uh, like I'm going to be an artist, I'm going to freelance, I'm going to make money just doing this, this thing. And there wasn't really a lot of direction. I had to figure out a lot of this stuff all on my own. It sucks, you know, you get a whole bunch of projects on the go that aren't inspiring and really just don't have you know, they just, just kind of suck the creativity and, and joy of it out of you. And it's just like, I'm like, why am I doing this? You know, when, I, when I, I go six months to a year without drawing anything that is for myself, it's, it's, it feels really bad. I struggle with, with the, the work art balance all the time. You know, look, I'll think back and be like, uh, just, I should just go back to being a server because that was like, easy. I just go in and do my job and leave at the end of the day and there's nothing following me around. Whereas like, you know, um, when you run your own business, you know, people are contacting you at, at all hours of the day and night and, and uh, it's a totally different world. I want people to have their own experience and not be afraid to feel what they feel. And, and, and if they, you don't get it, it's fine to be like, I don't get it, that's great. And, and if you get like a, some kind of positive feeling from it when it, maybe it looks like a negative thing, it's like, well, that's fine too. You know, I, I get very inspired by the things I feel. Um, and to know that I am able to be a part of other people's like emotional experience, I think is just like the best. And, um, and knowing that people can like look at my work and still have their own individual experience without being like slapped in the face and told what to think. Uh, If it scares you, it, it's probably not a bad thing uh, to tackle it. Because, um, like I was saying before, uh, I don't like being stagnant. I don't like being bored. I like to be challenged. And, I mean, don't get me wrong, I like being comfortable. I like my comfort zones, but I know it's good for me to try and push myself outside of those. Because, uh, yeah, you only get to do this whole life thing one time and might as well experience what you can from it. Yeah.